Hey everybody! I thought I was recording, but apparently I had a dodo moment and ooh, I'm not ready yet. Hold on. I was sitting here putting this new eyeshadow palette on and hold on. Let me put you guys are me looking at my ceiling for just a second here, okay? Anywho, I realized I hadn't done a video in a while, so I wanted to do a video. There we go. Hello, where are you at? Okay, I gotta turn you guys around, so hold on. To rotating, okay. Hope you guys can hear me okay. Okay, and I'm, no, I'm not wearing a bra because I'm trying to get ready to go to work. I'm riding with Carrie to work. Anyway, I picked up this new color workshop rose palette. It was on clearance at Walmart for $2.44. It was like four something. And so I started doing my makeup and I was like, hey, let's just do a video. And I, like I said, I didn't realize I wasn't hitting everything. And my husband's in there, you know, I'm just doing what he's doing. So, keep that out. Anyway, um, and I just want to say, uh, you know, happy, you know, just catch up with you guys. So, anyway, happy new year. I hope you guys had a great new year's. Uh, ours was fine. That's my second cup of coffee and I've got to get it inside me. Um, anyway, and I started blending this out and then realized, like I said, the eyeshadows when I haven't record, hit the record button. So I'm going to be all over the place. Anyway, I hope you guys had a great New Year's. Let me know in the comment section what you guys did. We didn't do nothing. I worked. Um, I did go in or to work early. They had, they, we were so busy at work that they didn't have time to call me in. And I texted my uh, my manager, my one of the CF sounds, and she's like, "Uh, yeah, go ahead and come in." She said they were really swamped New Year's Eve, so okay. Um, by the time I got there and got situated, because I had to do a return, uh, we were only I only clocked in about an hour and ten minutes early, but it, it still helped. So anyway, I swatched this palette when I got home. I'm not having high hopes for it. It's got some of the shadows, like the purples, picking up pretty decent but some of the lighter shadows I don't know if I'm gonna work so I figured we could get ready with this and I got I just realized I'd gotten this new Morphe M165 slanted brush to do my brows I'm like ooh, I got to try that out so apologize I'm not being very professional here but let's roll with it anyway I hope you guys uh, also had a great Christmas um I've been wanting to wear makeup this entire week but every time I got ready to do that I had to do something else and so um I'm going in with the the pink that's right next to it. Light handed. Let's just oh well. That came completely off that brush. Oh that's a bad sign. And I didn't I don't think I tapped it hard. The, the thing is, when I'm trying to look at my, when I shut this eye and I'm looking right at that other eye, it, I can't see. I have to let my eyes adjust. I'm hoping now after New Year's here and I'm getting my vision, I'm going to go to the eye doctor and I told Carrie I want to get contacts and another set of glasses. So we'll see how that goes. Like I said, I don't have high hopes for this palette, but I figured we'd give it a try. Yeah, yeah, you can see that. It's like not there. <laughs> I think that was one of the colors I swatched that when you, you, it swatched good, but it's, I don't know. Let me get another brush. Let me get the 109 Senya Kashuk. I almost forgot who made this. Brush. And I don't have crappy brushes, I don't think. But anyway, let me know what you guys got for Christmas. I would be interested. Um, I usually just kind of got what I wanted a little bit. Carrie got me a robe that I've been wanting, which is good. Oh, that color's not picking up whatsoever. Ooh. And I want to do a purple and pink look too. I don't have a whole whole lot of time to play with this, but I've got this uh, Makeup Revolution palette. This is in the Flawless 4. So, and it almost this similar color. 
and I get better payoff. I got to wipe the brush off. But uh, yeah, we're doing okay here. It's just like I said, it's cold. It's uh, cold and raining here. Um, parts places west of us, like I'm talking about Fort Worth, they're getting. It's supposed they're shutting down like Loop 820 is what I was hearing on the news and so forth. But they said places east of uh, Dallas and east, we're just gonna get cold rain. Uh, we're above freezing right now. But I'm going to ride with Carrie. I, we have a, our Jeep is four wheel drive, but I don't want to get caught in it, if that makes sense. So, and he is off tomorrow. I have to work. It's supposed to be another cold rain tomorrow. I have to work 2 to 11 tomorrow. But he did say he would take me to him from work if I need him to. And I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to, sorry. <laughs> Someone's <laughs> pinging under, so. Uh, yeah, this you can actually see the color. The purple, I'm, I'm disappointed with that. Okay, it did go down because I mean, I use Too Faced eyeshadow insurance, and that does a really good job of keeping my makeup on. So, I mean, you get what you pay for when you come when you get these palettes, but and I haven't had a chance to use all the palettes that Trisha got me. Uh, for my birthday or whatever it was, so. That's why I have this palette out. Remember, I think it was about a year ago, I bought two of these palettes and I took one of them back. This is the one I kept. Because it's got all the colors I'm, like, wearing. So, let me put my Naked Cherry palette up. This is still one of my faves, by the way. Um, I... Thinking, I'm thinking about giving my Naked 3 palette away because I've used all the colors I could use into it. And I just, I, let, I mean, I use a lot of the matte shadows too, so. And I know I've seen on certain uh, areas, uh, certain online places where people come together and talk about makeup. They said that they have had similar experience with it. And you guys know I would not be quiet about that dang palette, so. Oh, sorry guys. I I know this isn't right the the right shade range. I'm just gonna go ahead and go in with the Wet n Wild Brulee. And I still need another angle brush. That's okay. Um, I got Trisha that eyeshadow palette. She loved it. Um, she actually took it with her on a trip and said it handled pretty well. She's been using it ever since I got it for, her, as far as I know. And. She's, um, I'm glad I didn't get her any makeup brushes because the ones I gave her out of my collection, um, have been, uh, working well. Last few days I've only gotten like one cup of coffee inside me and I'm like dragging. So. Yeah, we're doing okay. We're just, uh, Carrie went to the gym. He's getting back in his gym routine. I was gonna go with him, but... I'm on day, and I know if you go exercise, it'll help your period, but my, I just, no. I just want to it. If I could, I'd stay home today with all the cold and rain, but I gotta go make that living. So, and I suspect we're gonna be busy today anyway. I bet we were busy yesterday. I was off yesterday. No, they say we were slow yesterday, which is... I know it was New Year's Day, but, you know, you would think of people getting ready for this kind of a rain. It'd be fine. I like the way I did my left eye. But, anyway, let me know what you guys did New Year's Eve. I'd like to know if y'all did any partying. We stayed up more enough. I think we went to bed about 1230. We're, like, really party animals. <laughs> Oh, we're so crazy. Yeah, I've been sticking this in that drawer because it made more sense to keep an eyeshadow drawer. I had it in this drawer. I keep everything else. Um, I also got Trisha, um, I got her eyelash curler and she needed one so bad, she said, so. And I needed to get this because I know this is coming up on the three months. So, okay, I'm going to do my eyeliner. Um, I'm gonna just do black. 
I love these Rimmel eyeliners. Uh, I think they're really, really awesome. So, yeah, I think I'll do brown. I, I've been seeing people do brown with the purple. So, for sure, no, I'm black, black, black. I am gonna get me one of these in black. I thought I had one and I didn't. Honestly, don't. And I guess that annoys the snot at me. I haven't done that yet. I got my pencil. I had to look for my pencil there. I tried to go without uh, using eyeliner, but I, I think it. It's there's like a line there, and it helps define my eyes a little bit better. And cold oh, carry on wanting to dye my hair. Everybody says I don't need to, but. Because um, that hair dye I've been using from Revlon has actually been sticking better than the one from L'Oreal. Yeah, it's, it's my left eye. I, it, I have to focus. And then I have to go back and redo my eyeliner. And now I'm getting to that age where you just don't do eyeliner. But I'm going to be one of those older ladies doing that, you know. What my makeup vanity is all jacked up because I've been throwing stuff up here, and, and this is the other reason why I want to switch completely, completely over to automatic pencil because I wouldn't have to worry about that. You no know, sharpening part. You realize I got eyeshadow right there. I was just thinking about back in the day when I did makeup and stuff and a lot of you were trying to help me and I was being such a, like a bee about it. And I look back on it now and I'm thinking, wait, you all were really trying to help me. I was just being a pain in the butt. So, you know, and, and I should have just taken your advice. I weren't being, some of y'all were not being mean. Y'all were just trying to help me put the makeup on better. There's a lot of things I did. I think back to my YouTube days, even when I had a, my old name, if I could do it all over again, I would definitely you know, not act the way I was, because I'm like, I would, if I could kick myself in the butt, I would definitely do that, you know what I'm saying? So, I've been using this uh, particular mascara combo, but I want to bust out one of the ones I got in my subscription boxes, and I'm getting... No, I'm not getting another one in the glam, the Ipsy one. I can't think right now. So, I don't know. Um, let's try the Lancome. Because I know, and I don't remember which month. I have to look. Because I'm dropping stuff. Um, I've been keeping this journal on my vanity. That way I can write down in times like this, when did I get a product? So, um, September, and I don't even remember which. But it, like, and I've been I haven't been staying on top of it like I should have been. I think. But this tells me when I got it about the time I might have opened it. But I'm dying to open another one up. So after a while, you get just bored using the same products anyway. So anyway, this is the Lancome. Big is a new black mascara, I guess. It's the, it, it has this writing on it. I don't know. No. Anyway. Give this a try. Because I have not opened these. I wanted to keep the wand. This will probably, you know, because I know once you open these, you have to use these. And I still got eyeshadow. Oh, look at that. But the reason why I was talking about my YouTube days because I remember I'd have like a bunch of shadow like right there and I'll tell me, hey, get a brush. <laughs> and I was just thinking about that when I was getting my eyeshadow on today. You know, so. Goodness, don't worry. 
but yeah. We had a really good time at the family function. Uh, we did the white elephant gift where you uh, rolled the dice and all that. And I wound up getting my gift back, but I gave it to my sister-in-law, who, they have cats, too. And I bought it with her and mine, or my stepdaughter and mine, because we are cat lovers, or even my niece. So, wow. That, that's awesome. I like that. And, uh, so I gave it to my sister-in-law, Tina. I said, here, I had gotten this for you anyway, because I, she said, well, don't you want it? I said, when I bought it, I got me one, too, so... <laughs> Uh, but she was okay with it. That was really cool. I've got to go through my makeup and I had already decided I'm probably going to do it tomorrow. Go through my foundations and stuff like that and go through my eyeshadows and get rid of a month. You know, just do a purging. Would you guys care to see a video on that? See me like get rid of And I'm talking about really old stuff, you know, too, that I've had that and I don't mean so much sense of keeping, especially when I'm getting all this makeup from the subscription boxes. I'm thinking about adding a uh, play by Sephora because it's like 10 bucks. Um, I asked Carrie about it if he would care. He said he's fine because he gets that fishing subscription box and then I got him a ton of fishing crappie stuff. So he's, he said if I want to, that's fine. But I'm just thinking about it. And, you know, just thinking about my eye, you know, prevent myself from getting an eye infection. But there are some products over the last couple of weeks I haven't got, had a chance to use. I definitely love the wand on this. This is really awesome. Let me know if you tried this mascara. That, I like that better than the uh, Wonder Wand. And I like the fact that it clicks. Let me know. I'll shut it all the way. Put this mascara on. This is the, I don't need this for the length. I need this to keep me from my eyes watering. This is the Rocket Volume Mascara. I don't want to overdo it. I have spider uh, eyelashes. Yeah, I didn't really need too much. I mean, Carrie wound up getting a little tool set that I think he stuck in our Jeep. So. You can never have too many tools, he says. I'm like, as long as you can actually do the job right. Sparky. Oh, he got a... He got one of the kids that we work with. They, uh, it was a movie that they always, uh, him and Carrie always picked on each other about. Well, he, Carrie got him a movie and had some other people who were, were in on the joke uh, sign a Christmas card, I think. And the kid, he's a great kid in general, but he knows my husband's a huge Eagle, Philadelphia Eagles fan. He got him a fleece. I'm like, hey, please, I thought that was cool. He goes, hey, did you see what I got, Carrie? I said, yeah, thank you for doing that. I did ask him offhand. I said, how much was it? Because I don't know where to get his eagle stuff. And he was telling me. And he's like, yeah, I'll go, definitely go and check where he told me to check. So, um, here's my new brush I get to use. Uh, well, okay, a while back, and I know this is going to be gross, but when I was cleaning out our closet, back a long time ago when we couldn't figure out why, why, our, cat, what our, cat, why our cat was crapping in random places before we realized it was a litter. My Denver Broncos long sleeve shirt, the long sleeve sheet pooped on the bottom part of it. <laughs> that grossed me out. I was like, Ugh. I was able to save the Dem Denver, um, Denver Broncos emblem because there, that was not damaged. And my husband was like, well, why don't you just wash the shirt? I said, no. <laughs> so I'm going to use that to make a quilt. Well, my cat, Smokey Show, he came in there Saturday and I was off. I was over there cleaning my craft area up. He goes, I hate your cat. I said, why? He barked on his blanket. <laughs> he only barked on a little spot. I mean, it would it was enough for, for me to go and grab a paper towel, get it up, and then I have some laundry stain remover, spot cleaner stuff, and I got it out. And then the cat, is, is, his daddy is doing what he did. He come on and nose, nose on me like, Mama did it. I did good. Didn't I, Mama? 
I try not to laugh because I know that I said, well, I know how, how that feels. I said, well, now we're even because your cat crapped on my Denver Bronco, so now we're even. He, he didn't get a laugh out of it. He goes, but it was my Christmas present. I go, honey, I spot cleaned it with the laundry stain remover, and I can always wash that when I go do one laundry. I love this brush. Oh, goodness. Now I'm going to find an angled brush to put my eye highlight on. Yeah. This is the brush I got when I went and got Jessica her brushes. I said I got me one too, but it's going to be for my brows. I just got to fix my brows. Never do it though. And then my, I'm going to have them wax though. Just go to a place that can you fix my eyebrows, please. So. Yeah, in case you're wondering what that brush looks like, it looks like this. It's a really, really, really great brush. I feel like I have more control over this than I do. I mean, this is a great brush, too, that I've been using, too. It's just a random thing, but I will probably put that in my other brush thing. Keep my other makeup brushes. I definitely like this brow stuff from Rimmel And this is the Brow This Way brow sculpting kit really cool I didn't, I didn't use the I don't know what you do with the powder though I got a brow okay, I'm gonna pluck that because it's driving me freaking crazy Okay, I got 15 minutes. I gotta hurry my bed up. I'm sitting here talking to you guys. And I don't know was. Yeah, Carrie went to the gym and he was sitting there uh, going, My abs hurt. I'm like, Yeah, they're supposed to hurt. You gotta burn, baby, burn. Okay. Love this brush. Awesome. Awesome. Highly recommend that if you're looking for a great brow brush. Alright, let me move this out of the way. Because I get my face on. I did use the uh, Airspun face stuff. I love this stuff. I just wish the smell would go away a little bit quicker than some of the other ones did. But that is okay. I'm going to put the Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation on. And I'm going to, since I got some major spots on my face. Do the tart cheek sheep. I'm not sure I'm gonna box spots. I came in from the other day checking my tire pressure because I had to go get some air in my tire. My husband had to do that. I mean, I feel like a little kid when he does that, but I asked him to. Oh, look at that, my hair. That's gross. But, uh, I don't know how I got it up in there. It was like over here somewhere. He just <laughs> looked at me like I was pathetic. I was like, he goes, you need help. Yes, I did. So, um, I went back and got me an extra, uh, Real Techniques brush like that one I got, Trisha. And, so, yeah, it's different from the other one I have. So, I figured we would try this out. This brush. But yeah, I really like the airspun um, powder. I'm gonna wear that today, probably. Wear my new um, lipstick I got from Dollar Tree. That I love. You don't know. I'm crazy about that. Mini buffing brush, huh? Okay, we'll see. Hmm. Let me know if you got this brush, like in a full size version. So it's supposed to be good for your foundation. That's one of the reasons why I got it for. Not too bad. Oh, 
always careful about putting too much product on my face because you don't want to waste it. I'm going to go over like this. I still feel like I'm going to need another brush to get underneath the eyes though. This is like one of my favorite Eco Tool brushes. It's the micro blending brush. Oh. You need a new uh, under eye brush. Highly recommend that. I got that on clearance at Walmart a while back. But anyway. I, I wish I could tell you there's a lot going on or there's really not. Um, Saturday I may get together with Julie, my BFF. She came by, like I said, she came by yesterday. She just could not wait for me to open those presents. Uh, so she got me some stuff. She got me nail polishes, hand sanitizer, and some hand cream I gave her. Uh, body spray lip balm and some candy I, I sent one home with her to her husband and she's like no I'm taking out I'm like okay you go right on in I like the brush but I just wish it was a little bit more like this where it's just shorter you know what I'm saying Carry to drive it. Oh, it's my hair. That's a decent brush. Okay. I'm so happy I, I went and replaced my real. This is my new Real Techniques brush, too. So, okay. Oh, sorry, guys. I have to be really careful. Oh, way too close. Eh, it happens. I am thinking about getting me a thing to put you guys on so I don't have to keep doing that. It embarrasses me. So. Yeah, I just don't care for the smell in this, but, you know, I was, you know, you're pre-warned about that. I'm going with the, this is like my go-to powder brush. When you guys know in case you carry the rest anyway. So while I'm thinking about it, I really like that that's a mascara I picked out. I think how my mascara really impressed me. We'll see how it lasts on me all day. Really nice mascara. I want to make sure I don't forget that lipstick because I was all excited when I found that lipstick. But they're this annoy. I mean, I could have fixed the other the the other lipstick, but I just didn't want to. And so I got several of those babies when I was at that Dollar Tree. I had the hardest time getting my uh, grandson something. So we found them some cars. Um, I found they were like five bucks. There are two cars in it, but they're interchangeable. Small cars. They just kept away from them, so they put them up, which is good. He's easy. You get him cars. He'll be set. My granddaughter is really a lot easier to shop for, honestly. So I told Carrie, you're in charge of the grandson shopping. So. I'm trying to make sure I don't forget nothing. I had a customer of mine come in and I told her I make my own setting spray. She went and made it, and she came by and told me recently she really loved it. And I saved her some money, so I thought that was pretty good. But I, I look like I'm... I look like I'm like a ghost or something. This is the Ulta uh, Medium Powder Brush. I usually take this to finish. And I'm going to grab a lip liner. Set my face. But this is the lipstick I told you guys. This is a uh, vibe. It's a diaper. All-time favorite lipstick. 
And I'm going to end this here. Thank you guys very much for hanging with me. Uh, let me know if you guys want to see a declutter video. I'll, I'll try to get that up within a week if you guys want to see it. we got to split because we've got to leave on time. So uh, thank you for watching.